This is like one of my favorite things to do. I just got shipments from, uh, what's it called? Tropical Traditions, Healthy Traditions. I have the link in my bio for these. This is my favorite. I know it says hair oil, but body everything. Magical. Oil. It pretty much smells just about like nothing. Um, it has this blend of oils that I love. They're all organic. What these oils is they have a different type of oil to penetrate basically every layer of your skin. So you've got jojoba, which is like one of the most um, deeply penetrating healing oils. You also have virgin coconut oil. You have macadamia nut oil, rosehip oil, shea butter, and carrot seed oil. All these oils penetrate different layers of the skin. And the heaviest ones, like shea butter and Locked coconut in. oil, whatever essential oils you add to this so that they work in your bloodstream better and they get stored longer. So it makes the oil also, it makes the essential oils less volatile. So they will actually oh, last. This is longer. my favorite. This is the oil that I'll use a lot of times in the shower that I scrub my body with with loofah gloves because I'm not into using lots of soaps. Hydrating the skin is the best way to cleanse it, like oil cleansing, rather than using soaps actually, to actually. dry the surface layer of the skin. So they lock in whatever dirt, bacteria, whatever it is underneath. So it's not deeply penetrating the skin and cleaning it. And that's why I like to what I call oil wash. And I use loofah gloves and All wash you my need body. Is a little bit for your whole body. It's awesome. And there's a couple different kinds that I use from Tropical Another Tradition. one, it's quite a bit less expensive. This one is $20 a bottle. And this one is like $13 a bottle. This one has black seed oil in it, has a little bit stronger of a scent. So not as good for the DIY blends as this one. But as you can see that Tropical Traditions makes or Healthy Traditions makes is tested for glyphosate. Every single ingredient, every single product that they sell, all the Florahana essential oils, glyphosate free, every single product they make is not only organic, but tested, they sell as well. But I wanted to show you um, something that's really fun to have as little gifts and holiday season is coming up. It's around the corner, it's almost October. Um, so I wanna show you something that's These really- These are mini essential oil roller balls. So um, they're so cute, like they're like the perfect little gift size to like throw in a stocking or give us an extra to like girlfriends. So this set of roller balls and they come with the tops that you plug in and these are not plastic, they're glass. So don't be fooled. A lot of the ones that they make are pla plastic. These are glass. Lids. So when you're done, you have a tight lid. Vivoplex is the best brand on Amazon. Their glass bottles are amazing. I've used them for many, many totally years. Sterile, clean. And then these Moo.com labels. I love buying these. They're so inexpensive. You can create any kind of label you want. Um, take any little logo. You can design it yourself. There's a big sale on their website. And I love... They're sticker books because they're super cheap. They're $6.99 right now for 90 stickers. Plus, if you use my link, you get an extra 25% off your first order. These Dirt cheap. in these books, and you can have as many designs as you want. You can have five different designs. You can design them all on their website. I love it. I use their stickers all the time. And you can create, it, it can say essential oil perfume or whatever, like, you want little stickers for cold busters. Um, with these essential oils because this blend is the kid safe blend for diffusing um, You can also roll it on if you dilute it uh, But yeah, you can have any kind of little stickers these bottles made. perfectly. They're adorable So um, what you can do is you can take your carrier oil like this one uh, dump it into a Pyrex and then add something either like um, I love honey bell if you're gonna do a little essential oil do roller balls. You just add the carrier oil in here and then you would pour, I don't know, you, you do as many drops as as strong as you want it to be. So start with like 20 or 30 drops in like, you know, four ounces and see how that smells, stir it up. Honey bell in there. And then they even come, this box comes with the droplets. So you literally can suck it up and put it, fill them all up. 24 roller balls with the droplets, everything you need. It's 10 bucks on Amazon, $10, 24 little gifts. Um, the smaller bottle of Honey Bell, I think is like $10. Um, the carrier oil is 20. I mean, with it's your kids, so... you could even get shrink wrap and just use a hair dryer and, you know, seal them all up to make them look totally professional with your little professional stickers and make them adorable. I just made this one really quick. I put about 15 drops of Honey Bell in there. And what I love is the color of the oil looks like perfume too, because it's like 
that's kind of like the just the natural color so you could have it say essential oil perfume like all natural organic essential oil People perfume will be super thrilled you could make ones that just have peppermint lavender and carrier oil so they're like calming you could name them whatever you wanted do them with the kids sell them at craft fairs people will go and literally nuts. like it's such an inexpensive fun way to share like your little essential oil projects but like i said this is ten dollars it comes with the pipettes the lids everything that you need on amazon i put the link in my link tree for them because uh, link um for moo.com uh, it gives you 25% off your first purchase. And right now these are all on sale 35% off and you can use it on top of it. So it makes them like so cheap design fun stick for tropical traditions. You don't get any extra discount. Um, but they give me a little coupon when you guys use that. So it's so cool. Um, so basically you can get your es organic essential oils or your this body is the oil. base of my healing oil that I make. And I use all Florahana like organic essential oils in it. Um, and it's just phenomenal. My base used to be this one, um, but I upgraded it to the this one, price, but I upgraded the oil to a better one that was more deeply penetrating. Um, but I also chose this one because it doesn't really, oh, um, much. if it gets cold because it doesn't have the palm oil in it. So it just works better for the pump. I'm getting ready to make a batch. I already have them labeled. I have new beautiful labels for my healing oil. You can kind of see my little healing kitty. Like, I like to do this kind of stuff because I just love to be creative and I think it's really fun. And I just studied aromatherapy for so long. Um, so I just love it, anything that has to do with aromatherapy because it just makes people feel better and it makes them happy. Put all this stuff in my highlights because you might want to look back on it down the road when you are trying to scramble stocking stuffers together. Um, my, my kids literally love their little essential oil perfumes. of all of this these are all essential oils <laughs> uh, and then all those and then one more box of these because i literally i just love this stuff i just love it i know i've told this story before but when i lived in a moldy house that i didn't know was moldy and someone introduced me to essential oils it was actually my massage therapist she also introduced me to the bio telling me to use essential oils for my muscles and she had a certain combo that just helped calm my muscles down so much i was like wow these are really yeah. powerful um my cousin was like oh you should diffuse oils and there literally was like a couple diffusers on the market wasn't very popular this was many years ago like i mean like nine or ten years ago i started yeah. diffusing oils and it was killing the mold in my home and making me feel so good that i was just diffusing all over the house i thought i was like a new human being because the mold was making me so sick and it was helping with the mold. It didn't helping take it away. I could breathe. My sinuses were clearing up. And like, I felt like I just kept getting sick after sick after sick. And that's when I realized like how powerful essential oils were. And that's how I started my YouTube started channel, re reviewing all the companies for essential oils. And that was when I realized the essential oil safety was so important because there was a lot of dangerous stuff circulating oils. A lot of people didn't know that they needed to dilute essential oils before using them topically. Um, what kind of dilutions people didn't know what to consume and what not to consume injured. So I ended up making a video and it was more about essential oil safety. Uh, but I always tell people get a really good essential oil. My favorite book is aromatherapy for natural living by Ann Kennedy. I literally have read it like a hundred times. I use it all the time. It's probably, yeah, it's actually sitting right over here. I talk about it a lot, but I know there's some new people on here, um, but it is my favorite essential oil. Um, you can click through this if you've heard me talk about it before. I just love this book. It has a reference of every single essential oil you could think of, almost all of them, not all of them. There's a couple that aren't in here. What they do, their medicinal properties, Blend useless well with in all the contraindications, um, like don't use on skin during pregnancy. You need to know those kind of things, right? You need to know what um, what oils are phototoxic. Myself, I gave myself some pretty hefty burns um, with a couple essential oils, putting them in a hot bath and hopping into them. I believe it was um, Panaway from Young Living that I really burnt myself. Oil. Panaway is my favorite Young Living oil. Um, but do not put it undiluted in a hot bathtub. You will do some damage. Um, but yeah, it's so good. So this book has recipes for just about Red. many, many. I read at least 
six or seven essential oil books. I got most of them from the library um, to find my favorite. And then this one was actually gifted to me from my best friend. I was like, oh my gosh, this is a book that I had, I haven't read. And she knew I love essential oils. So she saw it at Whole Foods and grabbed it for me. Um, and probably grossly overpaid for it. Cause it's like a lot less on Amazon. That's why I love her. Cause she just thought of me. Good, easy um, to read recipes for everything you can think of. I mean, everything, such a great resource. So you know what to do with your essential oils. We have used these recipes, trust me. <laughs> um, if you know anybody that just wants to get into essential oils for Christmas, get them this book, get them a couple oils from Tropical Traditions and a carrier oil, best gift ever. Good. All of those things. Link tree in my bio, aromatherapy book, moo.com stickers, glass roller bottles, the Eden's Plant Garden. Therapy link, all those ones. So in case you want Honey Bell or any of those things, I just put them on my link tree because otherwise I'll get a bunch of DMs. Eventually I'll get a swipe up and you guys will be able to just swipe up very soon, hopefully.